Hey, Diddleberries, Dudettes and fellow Scooker Knights, it's Teddy here, the TMA and the Adventurers, and welcome to week six of Skookum Gold Camp. Miss Dee Dee and I are out heading into Jurassic Park, the lands unknown of Upper Deadwood. We've got the SDCs with us, two of them. We've also got the Gold Monster. We're going to do some scratching around in the places of unknown and undiscovered. Some of last week's participants did some good exploration, but they could have gone further. So let's have a look. Let's see what trouble we can get ourselves into on this adventure. Hey, Doodleberries, Dudettes, fellow Skookanites, Upper Deadwood, living the dream is Tuesday, which means the old guests are out, week five guests, they've gone. Steve, Blake, and Mickey are in town picking up next week's lot. Me and Dee Dee, <laughs> we have come up to Upper Deadwood, we're playing around, we're exploring some new areas for the potential guests. We've got the dream mat running. We know there's dream mats, lovers and haters out there. I have to say, we are lovers. We're seeing gold in the mats. Look at that piece right there. And we've got it on the indicator mat. Miss Dee Dee, she won't get off the shovel. She's like a woman possessed. She's shoveling that dirt straight in there. So I'm on rock flicking duties with the trusty stick of flick 1000. <laughs> yep, all oh, the latest mod comes here, I tell ya. No holding us back. So yep, yeah, we're having a play. We're having a dream mat day. We're on some virgin ground up here. And literally, we're just shoveling gold. Straight off the creek, off the tundra. We're working it, we're doing it. Stick with us this week. I've got a feeling it could be a good one. Ciao for now. Say ciao, Didi. Ciao. <laughs> what kind of day are we having, Didi? We are having a dream day. Dream day, dream day. Look at the dream map, dream day. Gold in the box. And as we watch closely, we study the mat and heather of the kitchen, creating their hole. Look at the mess they've made. Look at it. This is a pristine riverbank until they came along. Now they've cracked out some real good rock. Some bedrock. They're going deep, checking them crevices, working the glories, looking for that five ounce nugget. Okay. We all know they can cook. The question is, can they mine gold? Only if we had time. Only if we had time. <laughs> you make the time. The sun don't go down. Keep working. Right, we've finished our tour. We're now down here at the beautiful portage. Taj, to Taj, Taj, Taj. We've got everyone out. We've got two, four, six, six of our lovely guests down here. No, two, four, five, six, seven. Teddy can't even count today. Seven of them down here, beavering away. They've got a good half day of high banking, crevicing, moving rock seeing what they can find. Another two of our lucky contestants from Courtside. They've gone up with Miss Dee Dee to the Jurassic Park, Upper Dead Waters, and they've got some quite, quite amazing metal detectors. So they're gonna be looking at some good stuff. Uh, I've just heard one of the pumps has gone down. So I'm gonna go over, investigate, get it running again, and let our guests carry on. Give us a wave. Look at him, he's off like a bully goat. Yep, yeah, yeah. let's see what trouble we can get into this week. 
Oh, they're beavering away, beavering away. We've got stuff going on, we've got stuff going on. Hello, buddy. What's your name? Where are you from? Dean from North Dakota. Dean from North Dakota. And you are, sir? Andy. From North Dakota. Why do we know that? Father and son. Yep. Oh, look, there's another son. Who are you? Where are you from? I'm Josh. I'm from North Dakota as well. And look, he's got a camera. He's a cameraman. Look, it says it on his shirt. How are you guys doing? You had a good morning so far? Yeah. Enjoy the tour? Yeah. I didn't bore you too much? Oh, Bit of a ride, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. A lot of rain. A lot of rain this morning. Yeah, the rain stopped. That's good. Overcast, but the rain has stopped here in absolutely gorgeous Portage. Look at that view down there. Absolutely stunning. So, yep. Yeah, dad's here. Making the kids work. Making them earn their inheritance of gold bars. And that's just the way we like it. Look at it. He's frying buckets at him as well now. So, yep, yeah, no, brilliant stuff. I'm sure we'll be seeing a lot more of these throughout the week. But, yeah, look at it. Look at the gravels, clay layers. Oh, oh there's some pay dirt there. This one's got a crash. Good luck. We'll be back soon. These lads have got their game face on. Look at them. They're moving dirt, moving rock. I think it's game time this week down at Skookum. These guys mean business. Look at them go. I can see some good stuff coming this week. And as we watch Miss Helen of the kitchen busy panning away looking at her spoils. Matt's getting the bottle of snuffer to collect on their bounty. Busy beavering away they've been. Oh, they're going in for the snuff. Just need to make sure they don't sneeze. Even snuff, snuff. Look at them go. Now the question is, did they get anything? <laughs> See, I asked these young bucks to go mining, and instead they've decided to go tunneling. I think they're trying to make a tunnel going back to the lower 48. Look at them, they're going down. And that's it, using the lever bar and rocks, picking it up bit by bit. Dad supervising. Putting the work in, looking for the big stuff. That's what we're all about. You want the big stuff. <laughs> Bring the young blood. Makes sense. Cleaning off all them gravels and the clay from underneath. for the team look at all them gravels underneath look at it all fine looking pay now after all that effort did it pay off that's going to be the question we'll know tonight, we'll know tonight that's for sure Folks, so we're down here at Deadwood. We've left you alone this week. We haven't had much content because we've been too busy gold mining. 
but we're down here on the six inch we moved the six inch from the top brought it down to the four moved the four up a bit now we've got the a team on the case look at them look at them dredging away so we're just hoping to punch a bit of a hole at the front of the dam here ready to break the middle section to bring the jet up and then remember that section the four inch was on at the top there hopefully we're going to dive into that but with the six and move some serious material so yeah we had a mission yesterday moving the six we had some fun playing around on upper deadwood now it's game time got our game faces on we're going to move some dirt with the super six Well, that was a few hours of running the six inch, and uh, I think we best check in. How are we doing? Excellent, awesome. So, we got Papa Dean, Josh, and Andy busting their balls on the six inch today. We moved some dirt. How did you find your first experience of six inch dredging? It was awesome. Loved being down there. You saw a fish swim by, tried to grab it, didn't get it. It sucks. But, yeah. Absolutely sucks, doesn't it? Sucks, yeah. And it's the same as always. Move rocks, yep. rush rocks, rush repeat. Rocks. That's yep. it. And how do you like it down there on that last stint? It's like a different world. Yeah. It's really cool. And that big ass quartz boulder we moved out. <laughs> did you it's clean out all underneath it? Yeah. Absolutely champion. It really sucks. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to have a quick five minute regroup. Because Teddy wants a cigarette. And then we'll, uh, we'll clean out the box and we'll right. see how the hell we got on and decide if they want to come back for another crack tomorrow. So stay with us and let's see where this goes. Say bye. 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 Well, there's two more prospectors just got clean from the bridge. Hard at work. <laughs> hey, Doodleberries, Doodats and fellow Scoot Knights. You saw us on the six inch dredge earlier on. Hello, Hello Princess Dean. Hello. And uh, yeah, we've come back. We've done the clean up. Whew, I'm happy. I'm going to give you a spin around. See the happy faces first. <laughs> and we'll look down. Look at that. Absolute champion from what? Two hours on bedrock? Two hours. Yeah. Happy days. So that's gold in your pan, which means we need to see your gold dance. Let's see a gold dance, lads. Come on, give us the jiggle. Yeah, full commitment. What's wrong with you, Andy? What's wrong with you? That everyone at home is wanting to see your gold dance. What a letdown. What do you think, Dad? You happy? Yeah. Damn right. So, yeah, amazing day. We're going to finish up cleaning up. And I've got a feeling they're going to want to do the six inch again tomorrow. But we'll see. So stay tuned. Doodleberries do that, Scoop Knights. I always say... There's no such thing as easy gold. We just make it as easy as we can. And then some people complain about moving rocks. 
And then you look at Miss Dee Dee, who's a goddamn machine, one of the hardest working people I've ever met, and she is dragging this four inch upstream like a goddamn pack mule, just showing if you put the hard work in, you'll get the results. Now, you might say, Teddy, why are you stood here filming her rather than helping? Because she told me to piss off. She doesn't want any help because this is her mission and she is bloody kicking ass. Look, we even get a wave and a smile. Dee Dee in her happy place. But I am going to stop recording now, get down there and give her a hand because that woman has just dragged it up a waterfall behind the bush there all the way up here and she's probably a third of the way so we're gonna give her hand okay folks <laughs> see you soon she's still freaking going look at her still freaking going <laughs> time out time out sit down before you fall down right this isn't a spectator sport i'm gonna give miss Didi a hand we're aiming for the bedrock outcrop there so she can start getting onto some of that shiny bust and open the bedrock. She's working hard and loving it. Look at it. Right, we'll do this and then down to the lads on the six inch. Happy days in Alaska in a heat wave, 87, 88. Teddy's hot, I'm getting in the water in a minute. Ciao for now. I just want to say, some of the people I've met here at Scoopin is amazing. Dee Dee, you're a legend. Dean, Andy, Josh, top, top guys. Yeah, that's right, folks. we got the brothers helping each other dress here on Deadwood. Yeah. Josh has already been in for an hour. I did the first hour. Then Josh, and now Andy's going in. Dean, the dad, he's on tender watch as we ramp up the six inch again and get back on it. We're into some good bedrock now. Busting it open. Sucking up all them multi fine AU gravels. Getting that candy. So, yep. Get the six inch fired up. And then get back, back in the hole. I think we're probably at about six foot now at the bottom of the hole. So, yeah, looking sweet. Let's see what's nice cleanup brings. And maybe, maybe we'll get a gold dance. Maybe tonight. We'll see. Yep, stay with us. Hey, folks, so that's us all done down here on the six inch. We've had two days. I think it's been cracking. Had yep. fun? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We've got the clean out tonight, so we're going to head back, do a clean out, and hopefully show you some nice chunky candy. Happy with the work? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Brilliant. Let's get back. Woo. absolutely cracking couple of days with the lads on Deadwood dredging on the six some nice chunky fat gold coming out hey folks so it's Tuesday and that's the end of week six good week some hot weather to finish it off as always on a Tuesday me and Miss Dee, Dee come down for a little play and we've we're down on the six inch it did some good work last week so we're gonna carry on punching some holes the crew's down in town picking up the new guests so we're gonna have some fun Miss D's in there. 
Working like a gold dog. Working that nozzle, getting the gravels, trying to get down to the bedrock. And then we'll start busting it open. So maybe, let's jump in there and see how she's getting on. Some cracking looking gold coming out of Skookum Gold Camp this week with some real chunky, nice looking stuff from Deadwood. Also, the Detector Boys, even though they didn't have much luck swinging, they still won the Golden Shovels. So here's to another week coming.